day. Hopefully I just landed in uh, New York. I'm so excited to be back for a little bit. And today I'm gonna show you how to take the AirTran from JFK into Manhattan. So here we go. Once you're off of the plane, follow the directions. Depending on what terminal you fly into, you're probably going to want to take the AirTran to the train. When you get to the AirTran, you want to go to the Jamaica stop if you're going into Manhattan. So you can see up here, the red line is Jamaica. So we're going to wait two minutes and get on the train there. And then after that, we'll get a subway card and ride the subway into the city. to your metro card which you're gonna get over there and then if you're taking the train into the city which we are we're adding an additional 275 um, depending on if you're gonna be in the city a while you may want to get like a weekly unlimited card I think they're around like 33 so if you are planning on using the subway at least 12 times it makes financial sense to get the unlimited the only catch with the unlimited is only one person can use the card. If you put cash on the card, you can you know, pass it back to the next person in your party and just use it until the cash is off. So it's up to you how you want to do it. Um, when I'm here with my mom, normally I'll just um, get unlimited for myself because I'm normally here a lot longer than she is and then get her a card with cash on. But again, up to you how you want to do it. The main key is when you're coming out of JFK, you want to put at least like $12 on your card to make sure you've got enough to pay out of AirTran and onto the subway. So now we're going to take the escalator down and get on the train. So I just got to Forest Hills 71st and I'm transferring from the E either to the F or the R, whichever comes first. Uh, so we'll see. And then after that, should be, I think, another like 20 minutes into Manhattan. Depending on where your hotel is in Manhattan, you may or may not want to be taking this train line. But for me, it's the easiest way. So this is what I'm showing you. Um, what you can do is download like the MTA app and put the hotel address in and it will tell you how to get to whichever hotel you're going to. You can also use like Google Maps gives you directions. Pretty much I think any map service will show you what subway lines to take. I always just wait and check like when I land if I don't already know the way because a lot of the time if there's delays, it'll take that into account and tell you the quickest way to get there. So do your research, but generally this is how you get to Manhattan. <laughs> 